Hello. Uh, as moms, let's come together again today and lift our adult children in prayer. Today, we will intercede specifically for their physical and emotional well-being. Hi, I'm Tope from Hidden Treasures and Riches. Uh, join me again as we see God's face uh, for adults, children's emotional and physical well-being. And our focus uh, scripture for today's prayer is from 3 John, verse, uh, 3 John 1, verse 2. And it says, Dear friend, I pray that you may enjoy good health and that all may go well with you, even as your soul prospers. Um, so let's, we'll, let's start by praying uh, for their physical and emotional well-being for our adult sons and daughters. While our children are living at home, uh, we saw them daily and so we could be in tune with where they were physically and emotionally, uh, right? But then once they leave home, it's hard to tell what's going on with them. Uh, I know f uh, as a fellow mom, I know that when my children left home for college, uh, this was one area that concerned me. I would often wonder, how are they doing? How are they uh, doing emotionally and physically? And then I realized it was pointless worrying about them. So I decided to partner with God in prayer. And I would pray that they would be physically healthy and emotionally healthy as well. So as a fellow mom, I'm right there with you. So join me and let us pray for our grown-up children. Heavenly Father, we thank you for who you are and all the ways that you take care of all that concerns us and our adult children. I exalt you, Lord, and give you all the glory and honor that you deserve. Thank you for the blessings of being a mom. Today, I come in the name of Jesus and on the authority of the word that invites me to come boldly to the throne of grace so that I may receive mercy at the time of need. I come on behalf of moms and together we lift up our voices for our adult children's physical health and emotional well-being. Lord, we ask you to grant our adult children good health. We come against any physical ailments, illnesses, and we declare in the name of Jesus that no weapon fashioned against our children, our adult children, shall prosper. I speak the name of Jesus over all physical, emotional sicknesses, whether it is diabetes, heart disease, arthritis, chronic illnesses, or all infirmities by your stripes. We declare that our adult children are healed. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father, for protecting their body, their minds, their souls, and their spirit. Father, keep their minds from stress, from worry, depression, anxiety, and mental fatigue. And Father, Lord Jesus, we ask that you bless their mind with strength, uh, with uh, vitality, and resilience. Uh, may our adult children find rest in you. Help them to know, dear Lord Jesus, that you love them and that their well-being matters to you. Lord, heal them from the inside out. We ask you, Lord, to heal them. And Father, we ask that you grant them peace. Let we stand on the truth of your word and claim by faith that our adult children will enjoy good health in their bodies, in their soul, in their mind, in the name of Jesus. And we declare uh, soul prosperity. For our children. Thank you, Father. Uh, Psalm 34 verse 17 reminds us that when the righteous cry out to you, you hear and you deliver them from all their troubles. Not some, all. So as moms, we cry out and commit our adult children's emotional well-being to you when they feel brokenhearted and are crushed in spirit. Thank you, Father, that you comfort them. Thank you that you hold them close to yourself. Father, thank you for your divine healing and restoration. Thank you for filling them to overflowing with your peace and your joy. Father, draw our adult children near to you, Lord. When they face disappointments, heartaches, worries, depression, anxiety, grant them sound minds, Lord. I speak to them, to their minds in the name of Jesus. I speak that their mind, body, soul, and spirit align with heaven in the mighty name of Jesus. Heal their soul wounds, Lord. Restore them to good health. Grant them courage to persevere. Remind our sons and daughters that they are never alone. And I will end this prayer with Psalm 69, 
verses 13 to 16. And it says, but I pray to you, Lord, in the time of your favor, in your great love, O God, answer us. For we answer us with your sure salvation. Rescue our adult children from the mire. Do not let them sink. Deliver them from the deep waters. Do not let flood waters engulf our grown-up children or the dead swallow them up or the pit uh, close its mouth over them. Father, thank you. We praise you. We bless you, Lord, because you are the author of all truth. Thank you for healing our adult children physically and emotionally by your power. That same power that parted the Red Sea, that same power, that mighty power that raised Jesus from the grave. We pray, we pray and thank you for your mighty power working on behalf of our children. In Jesus' precious name, amen. Amen and amen. Well, friend, thank you for joining me in this prayer today for our adult children. May they experience physical health and emotional wholeness. And remember, as a mom, your prayers are seeds of hope planted in fertile soil and may they bear abundant fruit in the lives of your children. Uh, thank you again. If you enjoy this video, uh, please like it, share it and subscribe for more content. Also check out the prayer of blessings and other adult uh, children, uh, similar, um, similar videos on parenting for adult children. Um, if you want to learn more about how I can help or support you, Book a time to talk with me at hiddentreasuresandriches.com forward slash listen. The link is in the description below. Until next time, may God bless you and may his grace richly abound to you. God bless.